like the previous door does, but it's not open, it's closed. But if they got destroyed, that wouldn't really matter, though. But they still have to have a place to go. Right. Uh, so it's pointless to turn them. But what if you just try to destroy them? But that's part of turning. Okay. All right. Just make them feel you got one right behind you, so... All right. Um, Anything? Let's turn so they can get put. Nice, 400 experience points. <laughs> really? No, I'm just kidding. Uh, she make it 500 for the expression she just gave you. <laughs> it's like, he's really? Gonna, he's going to turn and attack the he, point. He, he, no, no. He doesn't do it. Did you get Uh, 13 to hit. You hit him. Okay. Drummer 5 to 7. <clears throat> Are in public, so. It did seven divided by two is three. Uh huh. So that'd be three point five. Let's say four. I'll round up for you. Uh -huh. Just so you know, uh, uh, Miller he casted bless. Or everybody gets blessed next round. Uh -huh. Oh, okay. And now it's initiative. A uh, three for the skeletons. An eight. One on Caleb. <laughs> Miss for the three. Mm. Second one on, well, actually this one's gonna turn around on you. Oh. He swings that long sword. It's got green moss hanging off of it. Oh, he, green. He, missed, he missed with the five. The one that's on, the one that's on uh, Ethan. He hits with a natural 18. And the sword plummet into your side, causing seven points of massive damage to you. You can scream if you want to, it hurt that bad. Nah, he's not a screamer. Oh. <laughs> but I thought I'd just try to make for the game. One attacks you, he misses with a three, and that's all of them. He tries to be strong for the group. Oh, the one that didn't attack you, that's what it was. No, he's going to hit that. Okay, yeah, because he has the green moth. That's right. Yeah. Okay, it is an issue, isn't it? Okay. If I cast Tensor's Floating Gift, can I actually command for Ram one of the end of it? 
the one that always reminds us about the glasses, too. Well, you know, I'm sorry. Sometimes <laughs> I forget, too. That's when y'all remind me about what y'all did. Let's see if that works. I, 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 I said, I already got it right here. Okay, 138. I don't think we have the same book. Yeah, it's just turned down. Yeah. Really? It's 138. I was off by one page. I'm so sorry, Mr. Yeah, yeah, it moves at a movement rate of six and a diameter of three feet. Can I actually use it to ram something? That's what I'm looking at. What's the call of it? I'm so sorry, Mr. Yeah, I'm so sorry. 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 Yeah
So you're doing five points of damage to you the head. Okay. Uh, I'll go ahead and do that one. Okay. That's my okay. And it would be uh, 16. So you hit him. Okay. The point. And it's just seven points of damage. Yeah. yeah. So you do two. Is it magical shield? Uh, no, it's not magical. Okay. So then you did two plus your four for damage, that's six. And that's blunt weapon. So he's down that meaning now. Your turn. He's going to attack that one again. Yeah. The natural 18 plus 2 is a 4 and a half to hit. And then 8, the, the 6 plus 1, or no, it's actually plus 2 on damage, so that 8 plus 1 is 9, so it did 4 points of damage. I'll just say 5. Your turn. Here comes this. In our class of seven, so you hit him. How come you hit the skeleton but you couldn't hit the freaking dog? I know. Like we're all starting like oh. six. Yours is yeah, yours is straight damage. It's that one. I'll use my crappy dice for the next one. Okay, he looks hurt really bad. You see, like some of the reels just breaking away, and it's kind of teetery, totting on its on its spines. Yeah, it, it looks like one of those. Uh, it's one of the things you put on dashboards, one like this. Yeah. That one I'm on still at Yes. Okay. Your turn, Dave. Mr. Magic. Oh, Mr. Magic. Yeah. This okay. is pretty good. I'm going to tell my dick, my dick <laughs> to go for fame on that one. Okay. Roll the hit. Make a deck check. You got 15. Oh, you hit him. Okay. <laughs> you jumped out of the way of the deal. How much damage did that do? I'll give it a die three. It would hurt, and he's going to scuff and he's got to make a saving throw. One point. Uh, I'm sure that's good enough for the, for the skeleton. Yeah. Did you have me? How many? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it looks like it's teetery totting really bad. Yeah, two, 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 Just missed by one. Oh, wait, what level are you? Yeah. Okay, never mind. Do the damage. Well, I thought two times. Just do the damage for the first arrow. Five or five or ten. It fell over. Okay. Second one or five? Yes. Yeah. Okay, that's your one. That's four. That missed. Miller swings his mace. He misses with a four. <laughs> One, two, Mil Miller, three, four, five, six. He's going after Miller. It swings its long sword. It hits Miller. And he suffers seven points of damage. Miller, Miller. And it is initiative. Eight, nine. All right. <laughs> Turn around. And dash him with my sword. Uh, 9, 10, 11, 12, 10, 12, 13. 13. You just barely hit him for 7. It's blunt damage. Thank you, bro. Your turn. He's going to attack it. A 12 plus 1 plus the blast of 14. Ah! That would have done. Five, six, to five by two is three. You killed him. Yay! And those are worth two hundred, so there was four foot uh eight hundred. So I'm gonna talk about it. Everybody like my radical ride? Oh, it's actually not a bad idea. 